Meanwhile, a ruckus broke out at a St. Louis jail in the state of Missouri in the United States. Inmates set parts of premises on fire, broke windows and even the furniture. About 115 inmates were involved in the chaos. Dozens of law enforcement officers worked for hours in order to bring the riot under control. According to one of the reports, the police used tear gas to regain control of the inmates. This was not any type of hostage situation. No detainee was hurt. This was not a situation where we were required or asked to negotiate with any of the detainees. So this was not a situation where there were demands being made by anyone. These were just very angry, defiant, very violent people that we house at the Justice Center. Latest disturbances have occurred due to rising concerns over COVID-19 and subsequent restrictions. In December last year, dozens of inmates were transferred from the St. Louis City Justice Center after two separate disturbances. Officials said that the inmates were upset about conditions in the jail amid the pandemic. Even though none of the 633 inmates have contracted the infection, tensions continue to rise. Mayor Lida Cruson spokesperson Jacob Long described the group of inmates as extremely violent and non-compliant. He also said that the estimated monetary damage is fairly extensive. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.